What's going on, guys? Chris Weidman here. Um, so today is the day before I get surgery. Um, I am getting a. Um, they're going to take a piece of a butterfly fracture out of my tibia bone. It's basically a bone that fragmented off and uh, spurred out, and they have to go in there and extract that. Uh, they also have to go in there, and the small bone on the back of my leg, the fibula bone that broke in half, is not healing right, so it's a non-union. Um, so they're going to have to jam it together and put a plate with three screws above, three screws below to make sure that it is going to heal properly. Um, recovery time is going to be, um, honestly, I don't really know. I think I'll be able to start walking again um, for four to six weeks out and get off crutches, hopefully. And then um, <clears throat> as far as like training, I have no idea. It's, I think it's just different for everybody, so we'll, we'll see. Uh, we'll see what happens, but um, the last three four weeks of my life have been super tough because I've been in limbo um, Trying to decide if I'm going to get a surgery or not um, It basically started with a doctor got my x-rays, you know a prominent doctor got it and um, he thought that My bone wasn't healing properly. Uh, he suggested getting a 3d um, reconstructive reconstruction CAT scan so you can really get a better idea what's going on in the leg and because of that, now I've had lots of different opinions on uh, what I should be doing. Stemming all the way from uh, taking the rod out of my leg completely of the tibia bone and letting the bones collide into each other better um, and uh, possibly plating the tibia bone and then not touching the fibula at all. There, I, literally so many different options I got put on my plate um, and it was really hard to make a decision and hear, who, see who was right. But over the three last three, four weeks talking to different surgeons, um, I feel like I'm making the right decision. Um, some of the doctors that I trust the most all believe that I'm doing the right thing. So I feel good about it. It's going to be, um, <clears throat> it's definitely, a, you know, it's a setback, you know, but just like life, you you know, this is what happens. No matter no matter what's going on in anybody's life, there's, you, don't be surprised when a setback comes. Just be ready to have a positive mindset and move forward. So here we go. Um, I'm good. I'll get through this and I'm going to keep you guys involved and uh, try to document it as much as I possibly can. And um, I appreciate everybody's support and prayers. It's been amazing just to see everybody, all the, all the outreach I've gotten uh, throughout this situation. So um, it, it means a lot, man. It means so much. So I appreciate it and uh, stay tuned.